Hey guys, jh one here and welcome back to another video. Uh, today we're heading out to the pond trying the uh, canoe out again. Uh, where are we taking the canoe out and trying to get on some more fish uh, in preparation for a tournament that I'm actually fishing uh, coming up on August 1st. So we're gonna get out there, we're gonna see what we can't do. I'm gonna bring the light rod out there and we're gonna see if we can get on some big bass out on the canoe. Ah, there she is the beautiful canoe that we are about to take in that pond right over there. Can't wait. Okay, here we are, one more, we're in. I'm hoping this wind, we are up in the shallows and we are getting shoved. This is gonna be interesting to say the least, but we're good, we've, we've trained, not really. We've attempted to train for this moment. This is my third time fishing out of one of these. Good lord, it's like we're getting on the interstate. Main problem is that this wind is just blowing so hard. We're gonna try. We are gonna swim the out of this jig and see what happens. Do I need an anchor? Most definitely. Do I have one? No. Oh, I just got bit. Okay, this will be the last cast and we've got a, that's a fish. It's a little baby. Baby fish. But this is gonna be my first bass in the canoe actually targeting bass. All the other bass I've caught in this thing. Oh, well, we're counting that. I don't even care. I think we're gonna head all the way to the other side of the pond. Get out of this wind a little bit. We're gonna sit ourselves on top of this grass mat right here and hopefully we won't get blown any. I've never fished this into the pond this late in the year. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead, reach in, grab ourselves a uh, Magnum finesse worm. It's gonna be a little bit bigger than the normal uh, finesse worm that you would use. We got the wacky rig tied on, let's See what these things think about it. We're gonna go position ourselves over on that grass mat right over there. But we're gonna do that, sink this down in the grass a little bit. That's a fish. There we go, that's a fish. Can't tell how. Oh, he's pulling some drag. We've got, it's like six pound line on here, I believe, so. I'm gonna be nice and gentle with him. All right, right through the top of the mouth. This is gonna be a solid, you know two pounder it's not it's nothing crazy it's a nice little fish though saw a little two pounder at least some i think this is definitely look at that right when i hit the water don't pull me out of this mat it's a big one or a good one he's gonna pull me out of this mat we gotta get back in here he all he's done is run how about to say, show yourself, brother. It's a good one. Solid, about the same size as the other one, about two pounds, uh, give or take some. There we go, another solid little fish. We'll take him. So much grass. Okay, well, we're gonna try the swim jig here. Again, this whole little area, I believe, is just a little flat. So I don't really think there's gonna be very many fish in here. I know where mo well, yeah, it's grass. I know where most of them are. They're right over there across the way. Well, there's a fish. That's not a bad one. Buddy just came up and smoked it. Get in here, brother. Come on, nice and easy, nice and easy. Easy peasy, women squeezy. Okay, another, another solid little, I don't know, two pounder, nothing crazy. Nothing crazy, but oh, there he goes. <laughs> uh, it is a fish, and that is a good sign. And just getting down in all of this structure. Right when it hit, right when it hit the water, that's a big one. That's a good fish, that's a good fish. Right when it hit the water too. I mean, I tapped it once and it was on it. It's three and up, easy. Yeah, it's an easy three. Three and some change, or well, I give him three flat. I don't know if I'd give him any change. 
I'm not giving him change. He's three. <laughs> Saw a little fish, though. See you later, buddy. Come on. You're good. There she goes. Alrighty, guys. We are back uh, on shore. That wind was just too much. No anchor and the wind blowing as fast as it is right now. You can see it in the background. It, it was just not... A uh, recipe for success so uh, that didn't really work out but I ended up catching some fish learning some new things about the uh, canoe getting better I go ahead and end off this video on shore and we're gonna try and catch some more fish so I'm gonna keep throwing the swim jig and uh, let's get on it nice and easy on the bottom oh there he was that's a big one guys that's a good one that's a good one don't come up don't come up buddy first tap and he was on it oh there she is yeah that's what we like to see head to tail out of the water get up here buddy get up here yes sir that's the ground buddy i don't want to keep you on the ground that is good stuff matching the hatch this fish has been caught before you can see right there where it's healed over so hopefully this guy will bite again for that uh, tournament i'm fishing all right well see you later buddy don't tell your friends I'm up here. Well, my hair's messed up, but uh, that was so cool, guys. I threw it out there. As soon as it hit the water, sank it down to the bottom, first tap, and just a doom, and he was on it. So uh, we're going to get right back out there where we were. I don't know if there's more fish. Where there's one, there's more. So uh, we're going to go and get out there and keep throwing this uh, football head jig that we're throwing. I'm really liking it, and uh, it's worked all day. Alrighty guys, I think this is where we are going to end today's video. We're going to end it off at the lake. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I hope you learned some things. If you are new, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications because I will be posting videos every single day. So again, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Until next time, Jay Shimura went out. See ya.